Today we're gonna go over wrapping the limb of a horse. So first things first, we're just gonna do what we call a support wrap or a pressure wrap. So uh, things, materials you're gonna use for this type of wrap, in this case, we're gonna use a cotton quilted wrap. These can come in various sizes, shapes, padding. And then we're gonna use a standing wrap. You can use a polo wrap instead, but you'll see this is a little bit stretchier and a little bit thinner. So the most important part about wrapping the limb of a horse is you wanna make sure pressure is evenly applied. You'll often hear the wives tale that you always wanna wrap the tendons in. There's no research to prove that this actually helps, but in this case, we will do it just to be consistent. So we're gonna place the cotton, and we're gonna place it around the limb with even tension when going around the limb. Then lay it down evenly. We're gonna take our standing wrap. And in this case, I'm gonna start at the bottom. I'm gonna lay it there. And when I come around, I'm gonna pull around the back and place around the front and then pull as I come around the front again. I'm gonna overlap by 50% each time I go up. So you see about 50% of the wrap is covered. Again, tug as I come around the front, tug as I come around the back. Overlapping by 50, tug, round back, tug. This whole time I'm making sure that pressure is evenly applied. And you keep doing this. Once you get to the top, you're gonna leave, leave a little bit of this cotton wrap exposed. You don't want this to directly touch the leg. And we're gonna keep going until we run out of wrap. Again, overlapping by half as we go down the limb. Again, leaving a little bit of cotton exposed at the bottom. Coming back up. Even pressure. Until you get to the Velcro. And when you're done, you just wanna kind of look around and feel around and make sure that your pressure has been applied evenly from top to bottom. If you apply pressure unevenly, you can potentially cause injury to the tendons or the soft tissue structures on the limb. And that is how you apply a distal limb wrap to a horse.